but uh, with the world champion on the inside of you it is uh, a tough call to that run to that first corner but um, uh, who knows it uh, could just be Robert Lambert's night but uh, for Jason Doyle apart from one poor ride where he uh, just uh, got a bit anxious on the inside gate he has had a pretty smooth run through this evening uh, winning three races from the outside gate could he make it four here and the all-important final here this evening in Croatia it's been uh, a terrific night of speedway considering the conditions we've encountered and there's no doubt that um, uh, these riders really have dug in and shown great skill and determination to power their way through to get to the completing of uh, the completion of the meeting Jason Doyle on the outside he likes it there just doing a bit of gardening first final of the year and here's the lineup for it then Bartosz Marzik on the inside on a warning in the red helmet colour. Alongside him, Robert Lambert in gate number two in blue. Gate number three in white is Freddie Lingwin. What a night he's had to get to the final. And Jason Doyle on another warning going from the outside in the yellow helmet colour. Brilliant stuff here. Four more laps. Who's going to sit on top of the rush room? Stand on top of the rush room here this evening. Would it be the world champion? Will we see a debut win for Robert Lambert in the final here this evening? He's ridden superbly well. He's looked really composed here tonight as well. Yeah, he has. And uh, Freddie Lingren, when well, he's got nothing to lose, I don't think at one point tonight he would have expected to be in the final. Whoa. He's got the worst gate, but he's the only rider out there that's ridden in every single Croatian Grand Prix, so he's got the experience. And he's guaranteed 14 World Championship points, even if he finishes fourth, so it's been a good night for Freddie, even before the tapes go up here. Here we go, then. First final of the year in Croatia. Here we go. Continued Smartix out of shape now, running very wide, but he hangs on to it. Lambert back in second place, Freddie Lingren, looking like he's going to be on the rush on this evening, can just hang on in there. But the world champion out in front, looking good, set for back to back wins here in the Donya Kadiavec Stadium. Brilliant stuff from him. Yeah, Lingren's not just uh, settling for the bronze medal tonight. He uh, wants to get past Robert Lambert, he's got the pace to do it, but meanwhile Sparsvig stealing a march up front, just enjoying himself. Brilliant stuff from the world champion, one lap to go, stunning, got a feel for Jason Doyle, he was there, all but there, and just got himself in a bit of a trouble, and lifted, round the last turn, first win of the year for Bartosz Sparsvig, the world champion, back-to-back -back victories here in Croatia. The Millennium Stadium, fans on their feet, delighted to have won here once again, gets his campaign off to the perfect start here this evening under difficult conditions. He touched the tapes earlier on, he was under pressure, but he's shown great resolve and character, and the class has shone through. Yeah. Superb stuff from Smilesleg. That's why he's a three times world champion, he just works through difficult conditions, works through his own mistakes, and uh, well we've got... Uh, Robert Lambert also celebrating down with the fans, but that man there, Bartosz Smarznik, couldn't have asked for a better way to start the defence of his championship. Brilliant stuff. Superb stuff from all three there. Got a feel for Jason Doyle, who was just there. He just... Oh, he'd be a little bit right. he'd so uh, frustrated, but nonetheless, it's still a great showing from the Australian. But for Robert Lambert, it's not going to be too much Lambert before he is on top and winning Grand Prix. Great showing from him throughout the evening. He really has been rock solid. But you just can't count Smarslik out. When you look at the stats, when you look at the numbers, he is the man. He's too good. He is just a little bit too good right now. But I sense, with Wolfenden going well, Lambert riding strongly, Bewley's there. Freddie Lingren healthy. Freddie Lingren, yeah. yeah. Freddie Lingren healthy. There's plenty to get excited. The result then of the final is Smarslik out in front. He won nicely. Lambert back in second place, Freddie Lingwin on the ro on the rostrum in third place, and Jason Doyle, we'll see it now, just missing out. Yeah, such a bad luck for Jason Doyle. Gets across there, I don't know if it was a rut or it's just body position, but the bike just lurches forward. He's got absolutely no option at that point but to get off the thing, and a uh, bit of disappointment for him, but sportsmanship, he gets straight back up, wants the race to continue and uh, you have to take your hat off for him for that because he would have been feeling that he would be so disappointed but he's made the final fourth place but it's all about Bartosz Smarslik 
this race just gets himself out in front and uh, pulls away from the opposition with Robert Lambert coming under a lot of pressure from Freddie Lindgren. But uh, what a start to the defence of his title. Brilliant stuff. Yeah, the perfect start for the reigning world champion winning here tonight in Croatia. And as you say, it's the perfect start for him. And uh, probably quite relieved to see Ty Wolfenden and Dan Bewley not make the final here this evening. But nonetheless, Robert Lambert pushing on there in second place. Great scenes these are. So um, uh, we will see the World Championship standings after the opening rounds here. And uh, we know who's going to be out in front. It will be Bartosz Schmarsley who picks up the big 20 points. Lambert on 18, Lingwin on 16. Great effort from Freddie Lingwin. How has he done that? Jason Doyle, 14. Wiffenden, still good night. 12 points for him. Mickelson, 11. Bewley on 10. Solid start to the campaign for those top eight. Jack Holder on eight, Max Frick. But when you look down here, some big hitters. Leon Madsen and Matej Janowski. Work to be done. Nine rounds ahead of them, of course. But they need to find some form before they get to uh, uh, Warsaw in two weeks' time. So, celebration times with the uh, presentations to come. Smarslik, he's still hungry for it, isn't he? <laughs> Three world championships in four years. Just got outbattled in 2021, which was an incredible season by Artem Laguta. Um, but uh, apart from that, Bartosz Marslik is the best rider in the world right now. And um, I sense he's not going to have it all his own way. There's some of these the riders really beginning to believe that they can take it to him. But uh, all in all, in difficult conditions, he's come through in flying colours. Yeah, he has. That's what uh, makes him a champion. He... Uh... Just him and his team work so well together. You know, they're so relaxed in the pits. When things go wrong, he's touched the tapes. Uh, they don't panic. They just work out, how do we make it right? So now, let's get some reaction from the winner on the night. So Bartosz Smarslik is down there and he's going to be joined by Scotty Nichols. Yeah, I'm joined by round one winner Bartosz Smarslik. Bartosz, you came in as favourite and you just go and show why. Thank you very much, and I'm all winter missing for the, this feeling that I feel now. <laughs> yeah, you had the pressure on you, you touched the tapes earlier, you didn't have it all your own way, but you showed a lot of character to come out and win in the final. Yeah, but I'm very good feeling uh, on the practice, and after first hit, the second hit, uh, maybe tape for me this moment so better than the start from gate three so hard, and uh, after maybe, you know, too much change on the bike, that uh, when I uh, take the tape, I'm uh, staying in the same setup for the all night and uh, keep and keep and very hit so more better. It was difficult conditions. How good does it feel to win round one? Ha, ah, so nice uh, feeling really. I am all winter missing for the, this feel what I'm feeling now. And would you like to say something in Polish to your Polish fans? Dziękuję bardzo, że aż tak liczne grono przyjechało was tutaj, żeby nas Polaków wspierać, także dziękuję bardzo i do zobaczenia e, na stadi innych stadionach. E, walka o mistrzostwo świata, myślę, że e, rozpoczęta dobrze. <laughs> do zobaczenia. Your round one winner, Bartosz Marzlik. Congratulations. Yep, truly um, outstanding performance from the world champion, no question about that. If you heard it there, Kelvin. Bartosz Marzak is addicted to winning. <laughs> and uh, so, yeah, and uh, that's, that, that's not good news for the rest of the uh, competitors, that's for sure. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for champagne!